Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Good, Good evening. evening. Good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. Do you hear me well? Correct. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. Great. No issues with the microphone. Okay. Perfect. Uh, welcome, guys. Welcome. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Byron. Um, I see 15 people connected in this moment. Uh, it's eight o'clock already. We are about to begin a new model. This is a new model for you. All right. New model for you. Okay. Let's see 18, 18 people. Okay, that is perfect. Okay, great. Great, guys. Okay, we are, we are about to begin, don't worry. Okay. Let's see, eight o'clock, this is model. What model are you taking, guys? What is the model that you are taking? Gracias. Hello, hello. What is the model? If it's a question, question. What is your model? Who knows? Quien sabe? Who knows the model? What is your model? Number two. Number two, but the complete is the complete name is pre intermediate. Yes, pre intermediate too. Okay. Welcome, guys. I'm happy to be with you in this new model. We are going to do a lot of things in order to improve our English. Okay, 21 people. Okay, that is perfect. We are going to present. I'm going to present my computer. Okay. Just uh, let me know if you see it, if you can see my computer. Okay. Uh, do you see it that I am sharing? Yes. Okay, that is perfect. Thank you. Thank you very much for confirming. Okay, guys, uh, welcome to your new model. Um, I'm happy to be in this course with you. We are going to do. As I told you in a moment ago, a lot of things to improve, to make you better in English. Okay, this is how many models are you taking? Three, four, or how many? How many models? Like three or four, I guess. Three or four. Okay. Let's see. Um, I'm going to share in this moment. Welcome. Uh, we are going to 
use this presentation. I use presentation for all my classes. Okay, I'm gonna show you. What is the model? Yeah. Intermedio Modulo number two. That is the model, okay, that we are going to take. Okay, this is the first class. Okay. Um, Congratulations for being in this new course. Uh, together we will learn new things and we'll improve in different language. Uh, with effort and dedication to study will be better. Okay, if you if you take on account that we are going to improve, we are going to practice. Okay, yeah, um, we are going to read the indications in a moment. Thank you, Gabriela. No problem, I will give the indications, yes. Okay, welcome, welcome. Keep on with English, okay. Continuar, keep on, that is a verb. Keep on with English, okay. I need uh, one volunteer for the indications. We have some indications during the class. One volunteer to read it, please. One, one, one volunteer hello, to teacher. read. Hello, Me. hello. Me, Eliezer, teacher. Hey, Hello. Eliezer, nice to, nice to hear you. How you been? Hi, teacher. Hello, hello. Okay, Eliezer, help me with the indications and for the class. Okay, and some indication first. Your complete name in some platform. Example, Miguel Antonio Lopez. And number two. Camry on all time during Timini. Mm -hmm. uh, at number three, a cute place for a better concentration. Okay, let's repeat quiet, quiet. A quiet, quiet, place. quiet place for a better concentration. Okay, great. Uh, number uh, four, Connect at a point p.m. p.m. 8 p.m. 8 p.m. Okay. Or um, this is this is your your class. This is the, your class is at eight. Okay. Or a or five minutes early before the class. Okay. Five minutes early. Temprano early. Five minutes early before the class. Antes. Okay. Next. Uh, B. Attentive. Okay. Uh, number number six. No distraction. Uh, for example, uh, on uh, TV, radio, etc. And uh, the last one is part participation is always important. 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 Okay. Important. Excellent. Thank you, Alicia. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, if during the class, your participation is very valuable, valiosa. It is very important. So we can practice together. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Okay, what is next? Okay, this is important too about the classes and the platform. Very important to do. Muy importante de hacer. Okay, uh, your assistance as a minimum is 80%. That means that you should not miss any class. No hay que perder clase, okay? Percentage at 8%, 80, 80% minimum. Um, let's see what else. And the development in the platform. I will show you the platform in, in a moment so you can see. Uh, the connection to the class is 60 minutes, that means an hour, okay? That's an hour. Your camera should be on all the time, okay? So I can see. If you turn on the camera, I can see you. We can interact with each other, okay? That is what we are going to do. Camera on, okay, your complete name, the assistance, and, and that's it. That is pretty much the most important, okay? What is next? Let's see. Next, next. Uh, Okay, mm, let's see who I I have in my class. Ana Maria, hello. Hello, good evening. Ana Maria, do you have a microphone? Yes. Okay, 
Can you help me with, with the sentence, please? If? If you have doubt or question, ask at any time. Any time, cualquier momento, ask, okay, ask. And what is below, lo que está abajo, what is below? A question is, is a question, always ask. Always ask. Okay, siempre. Mm -hmm. Ask. What is ask? What's ask? Siempre what pregunta. Is yeah, always ask. Okay, no matter if the question is easy or difficult. Okay, ask. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, what is next? Ah, that is me. That is my profile, but mm, I want to stop in that in this moment. Okay, you can check it out later. Okay. In my class, in our class, we're going to practice four areas, four areas that are very important. Okay, let's see. Uh, Jose Rivas, hello, welcome. Good evening, Jose. Hello, hello. Do you have a microphone? Yeah? Uh, yes. Okay, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, perfect. Jose, what is the sentence that I have on my screen? To improve at English, we need it. Number one. We need speaking. What is what is speaking in English class? Uh, repetition. Repetition. Okay. Repetition is a lot important. Okay. Very good. Number two. What's listening. That? Ah, listening. Okay. Listen. Indications when I speak or when you speak, I pay attention. That is listening. Okay. Train. Can you read that? Train your ears. Ears. Repeat ears. Ears. Okay. ears. ears. Correct. Train your ears. I can train that loss. Ears. Oídos. Yes. Number three. What is number three? Uh, grammar. Grammar. Okay. And that means? Exercise. Exercises. Okay. That is plural. It's in plural. Exercises. Okay. Perfect. Number four. And the last one is? Uh, practice. Practice or? Mm -hmm. Review. Review. What is review? Mm -hmm. huh? Review, repasar. Repasar, yes. estudiar. Okay, that's a synonym. Synonymo. Okay, thank you, Jose. Thank you very much. Okay, those are the four areas that we practice. Ah, what we got here? Okay, tools. What is tools? Who knows? Quien sabe what is tools? Uh -huh, any? Any, any? Tools. Herramientas, yes. Okay, yeah. I use mainly three. I use uh, three tools in during the class, okay, and in many moments. I use two dictionaries. The first one is this one, okay, and the second one, and for simple words, no paragraph, okay, Google Translate. Sometimes it's very useful, but for a paragraph, no, don't use Google Translate for paragraphs, okay. And these two dictionaries are online, okay? And I'm gonna show you this one is the first one and the second one, okay? Those are the two that I use in the class, okay? And you have the link. I will share you the, the, the class, okay? The presentation, so don't worry. You will have this. Le voy a compartir esto, así que no worry, don't worry, okay? Um, pre-intermediate model two, that is your model. Okay, but before we begin entirely, after the comments are, um, we're gonna, uh -huh, we are, who can read it? Okay, remember four areas, speaking, listening, grammar, practice. Uh -huh. Who can read it? We are, we going, are going to going... watch a short video. Okay, we are gonna watch a short video. Okay, I'm gonna copy the link and I will play it on my computer. Okay, let's see, let's open YouTube because the video is in this platform. Okay, I'm, I'm copying a link, pasting it. Okay, uh, please uh, microphones, deactivate your microphones so we can uh, pay attention to the video. It's not long, it's not very long, okay. El INSAFORP 
ha trabajado con un alto nivel de profesionalismo, pensando siempre en incrementar las posibilidades de crecimiento para la gente de nuestro país. Nos hemos dedicado a que a través de la formación se generen oportunidades para los salvadoreños y así cada vez más, en un mundo más competitivo y globalizado, siempre existan en nuestro país posibilidades de superación para todos. Miles de hombres y mujeres han logrado desarrollarse profesionalmente y han ampliado sus conocimientos y posibilidades laborales a través de los diferentes programas de formación que son parte del Sistema de Formación Profesional, el cual ofrece programas de formación para todos los niveles de recurso humano dentro de una empresa. Se ha incrementado productividad de muchas industrias y cientos de empresas a través de la capacitación y formación de cientos de miles de salvadoreños con programas como Área Técnica, ofreciendo cursos técnicos para mejorar el desempeño operativo y tecnológico de los trabajadores. Competencias Gerenciales, con temas de capacitación para complementar y actualizar conocimientos para áreas de gerencia. Inglés para el Trabajo. Contenidos estandarizados del inglés para hacer a los trabajadores más eficientes y productivos en el desempeño de sus funciones. Mejora de competitividad de las MIPES. Amplios temas de capacitación, específicos para micro y pequeños empresarios. Cursos cerrados y abiertos. Tratando temas de capacitación para trabajadores de las empresas cotizantes de Insaforp. Insaforp Online. Cursos online, con el horario y ubicación que más convenga al usuario para la constante capacitación en múltiples temas y profesiones. Trabajando con el compromiso claro de ayudar al desarrollo del país y con un equipo profesional entregado a buscar oportunidades para nuestra gente, es que Insaport ha logrado tener un modelo de gobernanza y gestión ejemplar que tiene como base el diálogo permanente entre el sector empleador, laboral y el gobierno formando a los trabajadores, capacitando a la gente de nuestro país. Es que transformamos la vida de las familias salvadoreñas, porque en Insaport trabajamos todos los días sabiendo que, a través del conocimiento, es que estamos formando un mejor El Salvador. Con el objetivo de formar en igualdad el Instituto Salvadoreño de Formación Profesional INSAFOR, presentó en el año 2017 la Guía para la Prevención y Erradicación de la Discriminación contra las Mujeres en los Centros de Formación Fijos, donde se desarrollan programas permanentes de formación profesional del INSAFOR, cuya elaboración contó con el apoyo de la Organización Internacional del Trabajo, OIT, y su objetivo a largo plazo es contribuir a mejorar las condiciones y oportunidades de acceso y permanencia de las mujeres en los procesos de formación profesional sin discriminación de ningún tipo. La guía pretende poner a disposición de Insafor y de sus centros colaboradores un instrumento que les permita identificar, conocer, prevenir, atender y erradicar progresivamente Cualquier discriminación por razones de género contra las mujeres. Posteriormente, el Instafor desarrolló un plan piloto de implementación de la guía en tres centros de formación fijos. Y es así como surgen cuatro instrumentos fundamentales para la aplicabilidad de la guía, siendo estos manual de convivencia, protocolo de atención en casos de bullying y acoso sexual, lineamientos para la comunicación de los programas de formación con lenguaje inclusivo no sexista, y la guía metodológica para la prevención y erradicación de la discriminación contra las mujeres. Dichos documentos fueron elaborados con el enfoque de derechos humanos y de género, estableciendo medidas que garanticen relaciones de respeto, igualdad y equidad entre todas las personas que forman parte y conviven en los centros de formación profesional. De esta forma el INSAFOR asume la igualdad de género como un principio transversal de trabajo, entregando a los centros de formación estas cuatro herramientas que complementan la guía para la prevención y erradicación de la discriminación contra las mujeres, a fin de que sean puestas en práctica en beneficio de las usuarias de la formación profesional. Insafor, formando en igualdad. Ok, that was the video that we just watched. Ok. Great, excellent. Okay. Do you see the screen, right? Do you continue seeing the screen? Yes. Hello, hello. Yes, no. 
Yes, teacher. Okay, okay, perfect. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, thanks. Okay, uh, but before these, this is the next slide. Okay, before that, antes de eso, voy a explicar algo en español para que quede clarito, clarito. Teacher, y solo inglés no va a estar hablando. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, yes, we need to practice English. Okay. ¿Por qué está estudiando inglés? Let me ask you. Uh -huh. ¿Por qué está estudiando English? Hello, hello. Open question. It's in, es una uh, pregunta abierta. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué queremos aprender? Ah, ok, ok, that's good. Eso está bien, muy bien. ¿Qué más? Para superación. Superación, ok, para aprendizaje, hablarlo. superación. ¿Qué más? For search a new job. Para hablarlo. Ok, to have a para new hablarlo. job, ok. Para hablarlo, para tener un buen trabajo, uh, más oportunidades, sí. Ok, ok, good. Uh, yo como ustedes también fui un estudiante hace no tantos años, porque tampoco estoy muy, muy old, <ríe> ¿verdad? Pero déjeme decirle y asegurarle que sí, abre muchas puertas. Así que hay que esforzarse un poquito. Así que a veces venimos cansados, ¿verdad? El trabajo, pero el sacrificio rinde frutos y si está estudiando inglés, es por todo eso. Puede viajar, puede encontrar un buen trabajo, mejor ascender, hablarlo, hablar con una gringa, con un gringo, no sé, cuando vaya al South City y le habla a alguien. Ok, y ya pueden comunicarse. Ok, ahora sabemos que el inglés es muy globalizado, donde sea se habla. Ok, good. Así que le animo a que continu continuemos aprendiendo, eh, creciendo, etc. Así que estoy para ayudarles en lo que pueda y con gusto vamos a tratar de mejorar más. Ok, great. ¿Alguna pregunta hasta ahorita? Questions, questions. Una cuestión que tenga, ¿no? Ok. ¿Algún problema con el acceso? ¿Alguien tuvo algún problema con el access? Uh, no. 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 Ok, ok, perfecto. Ok, le voy a enviar ahorita al grupo de WhatsApp, los que están ahí, un documentito de blog de notas. ¿Qué es? Ok, ¿para qué sirve? Lo voy a enviar ahorita antes de que pase... Ah, pasemos, perdón, pasemos a algo más. Ok, estoy explicando esto en español ahorita para que quede muy claro. Ok, acá tengo, ¿qué es esto? Esto es un blog de notas, ok, cualquier computadora o teléfono lo puede abrir. Aquí están algunos links. El primero, Google Drive Class Presentation. Este link usted lo sprea, ok, le da copy y lo pega en el navegador. Ok, lo pega. ¿Y qué aparece ahí? Acá está la presentación de la primera clase, la que estoy usando ahorita, todo esto. Así que en este link va a encontrar eh, todas las clases. Yo se las comparto para que le puedan servir de material y de apoyo para cuando esté haciendo los, los assignments en la plataforma. Así que solo sombrea, copia y pega y le da acceso a esta carpeta, por favor. Cuando esté descargando este archivo, eh, dele clic derecho y le da descargar, download, download. No lo vaya a mover, no lo vaya a eliminar, porque ahí, si pasa eso, los demás no lo van a poder descargar porque ya no va a estar ahí. Así que es importante que solo le dé clic derecho, descargar y nada más. Okay. Clear, clear on that. Claros, yes. Yes. Ok, good. Yeah. good. Ok, ¿qué más hay ahí? Uh, acá está el link de WhatsApp. El URL. Ah, ok, acá me falta el URL de la videoconferencia, pero todo eso ya lo tienen, aunque yo lo envío después. La meeting ID y el password. Ok, y el link. Teacher, ¿y dónde puedo revisar los videos otra vez? Ah, ok, acá está el link de la reproducción de los videos. Todo se graba, así que en este blog de notas también lo va a encontrar. ¿Alguna pregunta? Hello, hello. ¿Questions? No. No, no questions. No, okay. no. Okay, no, perfect, no. perfect. Okay, don't forget, if you have questions, ask. 
Okay, great. Let's continue with this. Let's get to know each other a little bit. Okay. Uh, what is introduced? Can you repeat? Okay, we are going to practice the speaking, the speaking part. En inglés es muy importante que se practique todo, pero el speaking, okay, speaking. Introduce, let's repeat. Introduce, introduce yourself. Introduce yourself. Okay, and that means, it significa, that means, uh, my personal presentation, I will begin. Yo voy a comenzar, okay, I will begin. Okay, good evening, guys. Uh, my name is Luis, and my last name is Coto. I am 34 years old. I live in San Salvador. Um, I am single. I don't have any children. And I have a pet. I have a cat. And that's it. Okay. That is my personal presentation. Who goes next? Uh -huh. Who goes next? The more you practice, the more you improve. Entre más practique, más mejora. Uh -huh. Next. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Me who? Okay, cuando diga me, eso significa yo. Pero, who, how do I know? ¿Cómo sé? Me, Rosa, me, Luis. Yo, teacher. Okay. Uh -huh. Who said it? ¿Quién dijo? Who said it? Me, teacher. Me? Me who? Yo quién? Me, Jenny. Jenny Ramos. Okay. Okay, Jenny, introduce yourself with the class, please. Um, my name is Jamie. I am 41 years old. I live in Jiquilisco. Oh. I am married. Mm -hmm. Married? Uh, married? Married. Married. Um, I have a, I have a two children. Okay, I have I have two children. Two. That's it. Okay, good. Two children. I pets. Uh, no. No pets at all. No. Okay, no. and the rest. And what do we say? The rest. Y qué decimos el resto? Nice to. Nice to meet. You. Nice to meet you, Jenny. Okay. Nice next. to meet you too. Uh, okay, nice to meet you too. Thank you. Okay, next next volunteer. Okay, remember participation, participación. Uh, a gentleman, caballero, a gentleman. Uh -huh. I see. Me, Brandon. Me, Brandon. Okay, Brandon, introduce yourself, please. My name is Brandon. My last name is Barrientos. I am 23 years old. I live in Soyapango. I'm single. I have any children. I have a pet. I have a dog. Ah, okay. Nice to meet you. Okay, nice yeah. to meet you, Brandon. Nice to meet you. Okay, very good. Remember, uh, in negative is okay. I use a word document for the class. I use this to show you. In negative is I don't have any children. Okay, can you repeat it, Brandon? Okay. I don't have any children. Okay, that is perfect. Okay. Because you said I I have I don't I don't remember exactly, but was incorrect. But this is the correct way. Acá está lo correct. Okay, I don't have because he's negative. No tengo. Okay, nice to meet you. Who is next? Okay, uh, four minutes me. more. Me, me, me who? Me, me who? Ana Maria. Ana, okay. Okay. Go ahead. Um, oh, oh, come. Go ahead, adelante, ah. go ahead. <laughs> Sorry, uh, uh, my name is Ana Maria. My last name is Carias. Uh, I am uh, 42 years old. I live in La Gloria. Um, I am married. Uh, okay. I have two children, two boys, and I have a pet, a cat. A uh, cat yeah. as me, like me. <laughs> okay, yes. like me. Okay, great. Nice, nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Nice to meet you, Ana. Okay, perfect. Fatima Cepeda, next. Aha, Fatima, introduce with, with the class. Introduce yourself. Hello, teacher. Hello, Hello. classmates. Good evening. Um, my name is Fatima, and I am 24 years old. 
I live in Santa Ana. I am single and I don't have any children and I have two pets. Two pets, yeah. uh, okay. What, yeah. what type? What type of pets? Two dogs. Two dogs, okay, perfect. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Fatima. Uh, great that you, you are in nice this class. Okay, perfect. Who is next? Uh, three minutes. Okay, we, remember, we have only one hour of class. We got to take advantage of it. Hay que tomar ventaja de la, de la horita. Se va rápido. Okay, it goes very fast. Uh, Milagro, okay, go ahead. Okay, ne, after Milagro, Sofia, because Sofia has the hand raised. Yes, Milagro. Okay, teacher. Good evening, guys. Good evening. Uh, uh, my name is Milagro Yanes. And I, I am 39 years old. I live in San Martin City and I'm married. And I have three children. And I have a pet. Okay, a pet. What, what pet? What type of pet? One dog. One dog. Okay, great. Nice to you guys. And nice. the rest, nice to meet you, nice Milagro. Meet. Thank you. Okay. Nice um, to meet you, Milagro. Nice to meet you. Okay, perfect. Who was next? Can you give Who was? Me, teacher, Sophia. Okay, Sophia. Okay, great that you have, that you are paying attention. Great. Aha, mm -hmm. Go ahead. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Sophia Castaneda. I am 27 years old. And I live in San Salvador. I am single. I don't have any children. And I don't have any pets. No children, no pets, no pets. single. <laughs> oh, okay. At least you should have one pet. Okay, great. Thank you. Nice, nice to, meet to meet you, you Sophia. And next, one minute, one minute. Two volunteers more, and that's it. Take advantage. Toma, toma ventaja. The practice. Next, next. Me, teacher. Sí. Uh, Karen had the, the hand raised. Okay, after Karen is who spoke. King of Blue, who spoke after Karen? Yo, Karen. Me, teacher. Byron. Okay, great. Okay, Karen, go. Go, Karen. Uh, good evening. My name is Karen. My name is Lopez. I am 33 years old. I am, uh, I live in San Marcos. I like China food. And I have two children. Mm -hmm. And also. Okay, and pets? No pets? Uh, pets, uh, cat. Okay, one, one, it's only one or two. What? One or two pets, a cat. The cat. One, one. Okay, I have a a cat. Okay, I because it's singular. I have a cat. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, the last one was a gentleman. Era un caballero el que habló. Uh -huh. Okay, go ahead, Byron. Byron, yes. My name is Byron Aquino. I am twenty years old. I live in La Panga. I am single, and I don't have any children. Okay, and it's pets. Nice to meet you, teacher. Uh, nice yes, to meet you too. I and have pets. Two cats. Two pets. Dogs, cats, I parrots. Two cats. Two cats. I have okay, two cats. Perfect. Cats are very. It's nice are... to meet you, teacher. Okay, nice to meet you guys. And the rest we say nice to meet you, Byron. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, that was some introductions from us in the class. Thank you for your participation. Okay, let's continue. Um, as a first topic, is not it's not very difficult. It's pretty pretty much easy. Okay, we are gonna be speaking about some 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 activities. Okay, some, some activities. Okay, what is the indication that is below? Guess. Yes. Yes. Activities according to the picture. Okay. Okay, great. I'm gonna I'm gonna show a picture and you get a guess mm, the meaning of that picture saying the activity. 
Ready. Again, let's see. The first one. What is that activity? Exercise. Exercise. Ah, okay, exercise. Okay, exercise. That is the first activity. Exercise. Okay, very good. Next. Um, skateboarding. Uh, skateboarding. Uh, skateboarding is a sport. Skateboarding. skateboarding is a sport, but the activity, only the activity is skating. Skating, correct. Skating. Okay, do you like skating? No? Yeah. It's pretty, yes. uh, it's a lot of fun. Okay, good. Next, next activity. What's an activity? Cooking. 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 Okay. Cooking. Okay. Okay. Cooking. Great. Next. Painting. 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 What is painting? What is painting? Painting. Uh -huh. painting. Yeah. Painting. Good. Okay. Great. Next. Next picture. Please. Watching. Watching a movie. Ah, watching, watching movies. Movie. Okay, watching. Watch I like watching. Movie. I like watching a lot of movies. Okay, in some some series too. Okay, next activity. Camping. 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 Do you like camping. camping? Who likes? Do you like camping? Yes. Yes. Where, yes. where have yes. you gone? Yes. Where have you gone uh, camping? What place? Yes. El lugar. What place? Mm. The mountain. Ah, uh, uh, to the beach. Ah, uh, but basi basically, is a uh, mountains. Okay, for camping is mountains basically. Okay. Mountain. But you can do it at the beach. Why not? Okay, you can take a tent. Puede llevar una tienda. You can take a tent and you can camp on the beach. Okay, different. Okay, good. Okay, perfect. And the last activity is. Surfing. 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 Okay. Do you do you find exciting uh, surfing? Yes. Yes. Yes or no? Okay. Yeah. At, at the Tunco, they yeah. make a lot of tournaments, surfing tournaments at the Tunco and other beaches. Okay. Perfect. Good. And those are some activities that you see in the pictures okay what is what is the, your favorite activity monica marisol welcome to the model and good evening what's your favorite activity hello not in class maybe okay carla flores is in class carla yes, flores? Okay. yes okay it's... perfect what is your favorite activity that you enjoy doing Mm, I like the exercise and cooking. Okay. Okay, very good. Pay attention when you use the verb like. 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 When you use it, cuando lo usa, okay? Like plus the next verb is ing. Plus verb ing. Okay, I. Can you repeat it? I. I, I, I like huh? cooking. Okay. Cooking. cooking. The, the verb with ing is cooking because that is the way. As yes, I like cooking. 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 And what else you said? ¿Qué más dijo? Exercise. Ah, and exercising. Exercise. Ah, okay, perfect. Exercising. Okay, good. Okay, that's a good activity. Cook. I like cooking too, but not much. Not much. But exercising, yes. Okay, good. Uh -huh. And your favorite activity, let me see, Reina Lemus, welcome. Welcome. Hello. Hello, hello, good evening. What's your favorite activity? I like movie. Uh, okay, I like, repeat, I like watching. I like watching. Uh -huh. Correct, I like watching. Okay. Watching. Like watching movies. Movies, yes, correct. I like watching ing. The next verb is ing. I like watching movies. Okay, what type of movies? Horror movies, mm, funny, or I don't know. Romantic. <laughs> romantic. I don't I don't like romantic movies. No, those are not 
of my preference, <laughs> but you do. Yeah, okay, yeah, I don't like them. Okay, I am not romantic guy. <laughs> okay, great, good. Okay, very good. Let's see another volunteer. If I see on the screen, um, ta -ta -ta -ta, Jenny Bautista, and your your favorite activity. Uh, I like running. Oh, I like running too. Okay, that is my favorite activity of exercising. Okay. Great, that is great. Ivania Gomez is in class. Welcome. Yes, teacher. Okay, what about I you? Like, I like cooking. Okay, what do you cook? What type of food do you cook? Uh, chicken. Okay, chicken. Fish. De todo un poco. Okay, de todo un poco. In English, how do we say? Uh -huh. In English, a little bit. If this is a way, okay, a little, a little bit of everything. Un poquito de. A little bit. Yes, a little bit of everything. A little bit. A little bit. Yes. Okay. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, great. Okay, okay nice. Let's continue with the next, the next slide. Asking who can read the title. Who can read it? I have a title there. Asking about frequency. Uh, frequency. Frequency, frequency or frequency? Frequency. How frequency. do I say? Frequency. Okay. Frequency. Frequency or frequency. Mm, frequency. Okay. This is a good opportunity to show you. Okay. Guys, when you have uh, when you have doubts or problems or difficulties with uh, pronunciation, use the tools, okay? The tools, uh, where do I have them? Okay, use the tools. I can use less tools. Um, I don't know how to pronounce the word. Okay, I copy the link and I look for the word. Okay, right. there it is. Uh -huh. Let's see. Okay, this is the word. That is the grammar. And the pronunciation? Frequency. Do you, did you listen or escucho? Did you listen? Yes. Yes, can you repeat it? Frequency. Yes. Frequency. 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 Ah, okay, frequency, repeat, frequency. 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 Frequency, frequency. frequency. okay, frequency. very good, frequency. Okay, frequency. what does it mean? Um, what does it mean, this apostrophe? ¿Qué significa este apostrophe? Okay, this is phonetic. Phonetic is the way that you pronounce the words. When you see the apostrophe uh, at the beginning of the word, the stress, the stress in English uh, or in Spanish, the stress is el acento, okay? El stress is in English, acento en español. Okay, in English is the... Stress. No, es, no del estrés stress. del trabajo, stress. right? No, this is the pronunciation. <laughs> stress. Stress. stress, yes. Okay, when it's at the beginning, that is, the stress is in the first syllable, in the primera syllable. Frequency. Frequency. Repeat. Frequency, Frequency. repeat it. Frequency. 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 Okay. Frequency. By, by repeating, repitiendo, you will dominate the pronunciation of the words. Ah, it doesn't say frequency, right? Frequency. No. Frequency. It's a frequency. 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 Okay. Frequency. If you check, wait, if you check, it is very useful to use the tools. Very useful. What about this one? Uh, this is a Cambridge Dictionary. Uh, Macmillan is uh, British from England. Okay. English. And this is American. Okay. It is the same. The same thing. But this is for the American English. You can use it too. There it is. It shows you um, England. What is UK? K is UK. Ukraine. Ah, in English? United in English? Kingdom. Yes, Kingdom. The United Kingdom. Kingdom. Perfect. United. Yes. In the United Kingdom. Uh -huh. Let's see. 
Um, it's not working in this in this website. The pronunciation frequency. Okay, frequency. Okay, okay, but frequency. it is the same. Frequency. See, it is the same. Frequency. So the tools are very useful. I use them. Yo las uso. I use them a lot. Okay, good. Now you know. What are you saying? Frequency. Yes or no? Frequency. Yes. Okay, frequency. perfect, perfect. Frequency. Okay, what is the indication below? Any, we, any, we, we use, we use, often, we use, often, we use, we use, often, ever to stop, frequency, we use, often, ever to talk, we do something, okay, okay, very good, okay, we have two words, the words are often, repeat, often, 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 often. Often. often, yes. Some often. people, some often. people say often, but it is correct. Often, often or often, yes, both are correct. And the second is ever, ever, ever. 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 Okay, we use those two words to talk about our express, express or express. What is the pronunciation? Express. Express. Express, like with the letter A in Spanish. Express. Express. Gigant, gigant express. Mm, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure that is express. Let's see. Mm, let me look for it. Ah, okay. This is grammar. It, and the pronunciation is? Express. 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 Ah, okay. The, do you see? B? Express. Ah, okay. We sometimes, express. we pronounce the words as we see them. Pronunciamos las palabras como las vemos. But is not the correct way. Is express. express. Where, where express. is the stress? Guys, where is the stress? First, first syllable or second? The stress. Second. 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 The second. Because second. the apostrophe express. is in a different position. Correct. Right. It is on the second syllable. Express. Here express. 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 express okay perfect the express okay great um to talk about the frequency we do something okay repeat Open. what is the question uh, if you ask me, if you ask me, if you are asking me, uh, I readily, um, I readily, I readily watch cartoon, but I like them, but I readily, okay. I am using uh, a different word, not often, but often is for, 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 okay, let me ask you, uh, let me see, I will select someone from the class. Uh, Sophia, hello, Sophia. Are you in class yet? Yes, teacher. Okay, okay. Listening, listening. Let's practice the listening. Sophia, are you in class yet? Are you? Uh -huh. Are you? Uh, are you in class yet? What in is the answer? Yet. What is the Where answer? Is uh, how many? No, how? Yes, I am. What correct. is it? Okay, correct. Sophia, the question is, the question that I make you is, are you in class yet, Sophia? You say? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Why? Por qué? Why? Because. Ah, okay, perfect. Yes. Okay, because I have the verb to be in the question. That is good. And you need to answer in the same way, okay? In the la misma forma. Verb to be in the question, verb to be in the answer, okay? Don't forget that. Don't forget that. This is how you can um, practice your English. Yeah, I understand. Yes. Con solo que me diga yes, okay? It's clear for me. It's clear for you. But you practice the complete, the complete structure, okay? And we are uh, practicing everything in this part. Okay, Sophia, are you in class yet? Yes, I am. Perfect, okay. What is, okay, 
Uh, how often do you go to the park, Sofia? Uh, repeat, please. How often? Okay, I have the question. The question is... Mm -hmm. oh, example, how how often, often do you watch cartoons? Uh, no, no. Uh, not the, much. The, the, next, the question that I made you. How often do you go to the park? Not this one. How often oh. do you go to the park? Not to the park. Uh, not much. Not much. Okay, not no. much. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's see. Sophia, make a question for a classmate with, with the word often. Often. Uh, how often uh, do you uh, go to the cine? Uh, cine, cine, cine is in Spanish, in English. No, si uh, uh, cinema or cinema. The, the movies. Okay. Okay. The how question? often do you, huh? how often do you go to the cinema? Okay, and the question is for Ivania, for Monica, for Rafael. For, for uh, Milagro Janes. Milagro, okay. Milagro, are you in class yet? Yes, I am. Perfect. Uh -huh. uh, repeat, please. Sofia, can you repeat the question to Milagro? Yes. How often do you go? Uh, how often do you go to the cinema? Okay. Uh, uh -huh. How do we re how do we respond? Como respondemos? How do we respond? Those questions with often. Okay, let's see. I will show you ever later. Uh, let me see. Oh, 10 minutes. Okay. I'm dying, teacher. Um, yeah, but those, those words, we're going to practice them tomorrow. Okay. We're going to use these ones. Esta vamos a usar. We're going to use these ones. And these ones are the... Time expressions. Time expressions, Time expressions. yes. Time we can... Right we can use the time expressions okay okay let's link the time expressions we use we use, we time, use the time expression answer about the to answer. answer about the frequency frequency we just don't, we did we don't, some time. We do something something repeat something something something, something. okay we do something, something. okay something. let's link let's link what is link let's join unamos okay the first uh, time expression is every day every day every day every day every day what is the meaning of every day a menu uh, I mean, no, todos los días. No, no, todos los días. Every todos day. Los días. Ah, okay, every day, correct. Exactly. Every day is? Todos los días. Todos los días. Okay, perfect. Next. Una vez a la semana. Uh, but practice in English. We are going to practice more English than Spanish. You know Spanish. Once a week. 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 What is the meaning? Una Once vez a week. A la Una vez a la semana. Okay, perfect. That is the meaning. Correct. Una vez a la semana. What is the next one? The next one. Twist a month. Twist a month. Twist. 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 Twice, uh, twice. twice sounds me better. Twice yes. a month. Twice, twice a month. A month. Twice what is what is month. twice a month? Two veces al mes. Two veces al mes. Ah, okay, twice a month. Okay, good. Next. Three times a year. Three times a year. Three times a year. Okay. Year, year or year. What is year. the pronunciation? Year. year. Uh huh. Yeah. Years. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah. yeah. Okay, but this is British. Yeah. 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 It says yeah, yeah, but it's year. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Year. Yeah. Year. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna practice more American, more than everything. But the reason why the letter R is in the parentheses yeah. is because American American people or Americans. They pronounce the letter R, and British people don't. Okay, British people, la gente 
uh, inglés, ¿eh? pronuncia más la the letter the letter T. In American people, they pronounce more the letter R. 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 Correct. R. Yes, that is the difference. That is the difference. Okay, good. Um, okay. Three. Three times. A year. Yeah. Three times a year. a year. Correct. Okay. And that is? That is? That is? Three pesos al año. Three pesos al año. Three. Okay. Three. Three. Okay. Good. And the last one? Often. Uh, often. Repeat. Repeat. repeat, repeat, repeat it. Often. 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 Okay. Often. Imagine that Much. no T is there. No T. Often. Often. Yeah. Often. In March. March. In March. Okay. In March. And that means? Often. March. A menudo. A menudo. A menudo. And? Uh -huh. In mucho. In mucho. Okay. Very good. And the very, the word very, that is before, in means, ¿qué significa very in, in this case? What does it mean very before this one? Mm. Mucho, muy, muy a menudo. Muy, muy a menudo, muy a menudo. Bastante, sinónimos, sinónimos, bastante a menudo, bastante a menudo, muy a menudo. Or very much. Uh -huh. What is very much? Mucho. 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 Okay, good. Mucho. Okay, very good. Guys, and the reason why we use the time expressions is because they are useful. So, mutiles, they are useful. Okay, adjective, useful. Useful. Util, that means util. Okay. In, in my class, I use uh, the word document. So, we can, we can learn about adjectives, about verbs, about phrases, about everything. That's why I use it. Okay. Useful. That is adjective. That's an adjective. Okay, good. Okay. And, and often is for questions. What is the, the other word that we have next? The other ever. word is? Ever. 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 Okay. Ever. ever. We use what is the ever. difference, teacher? What is the difference? Okay. Can you read the sentence, please? Do you ever go to the movies? Okay, and can you read this one? How often do you watch cartoon? Okay, what 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 is the meaning in your opinion? What is in the meaning in Spanish or the translation? Tal vez tengo traductoras aquí in the future. A menudo. Con qué frecuencia? Correcto. Okay, in this one, what is the, the translation of this? Cada cuanto. Uh, um, yeah, it can be, podría ser, okay, it could be. Cada cuanto, mm, aunque no es tan común. Mejor decimos, alguna vez. Alguna vez. Alguna vez. Ajá, o alguna cada vez. cuanto. Ajá, correct, correct. Very good. That is the difference. Do you ever? Okay, but in this case, ever is for questions too. We use it for questions. And it is used uh, for negatives too, but that is in another class. Okay, could you, could you guess the meaning? Pudo notarle the meaning and the difference? Yes? Hello? Hello, hello, who asked me? I couldn't see the name. Quien me pregunto, who asked me? About me. teacher, me, who, milagro. Ana Maria. Ah, okay. Uh, let me see. Ah, okay, great. Could you see the difference in the meaning? Se pudo ver el, the difference, guys, in general? How often yeah. and do you ever? You can use both, okay? Basically, mm. they are the same. Son lo mismo, but in different contexts. Okay? But they are the same. You are asking about frequency. Okay, only remember that. Uh, how often? I want to know how, how is uh, the frequency that someone does an activity. And I use, I can use often and? Ever. 
Never. Ever. Never. Okay. Make me, make me questions. Make me questions. Ask me questions with often or with ever. We have two minutes, two minutes, two minutes or one. Uh -huh. Questions, questions for me, practice. Let's practice this structure about the frequency of the activities. Uh -huh. Questions, questions for me. How, oh, how open? Hmm? Okay. Auxiliary, how often? How often? Do you play video games? Ah, do you play video games? Mm, I never. I don't have. A, I don't have games. I don't have any console. So I. I never. I never play video games. Okay, good. Good question. One question more. One more. One more. Una más. One more. Do Do you ever go to the beach? Ah, yes. I sometimes. I sometimes. But sometimes is another frequency. Instead of that, I can use, I can use, um, oh, sorry. I can use a time expression. Oh, yeah. I go to the beach um, twice, twice a month. Twice a month. Twice a month. Yes. Okay, yes. Correct. Okay, very good. Okay, guys, uh, let's see. Because of the time, uh, we're going to stop in this moment. I will share you the blog, a blog of notes or the notepad. Le voy a compartir el notepad con el acceso de Google para que puedan descargar la clase de la presentación. Okay, uh, questions? Any question? Alguna pregunta? Any question? No? Any question. No questions. No questions. No worries. No questions. No questions. Me preocupa. Okay, but no matter. Okay, guys, see you. See you tomorrow at eight, eight p.m. o'clock. Okay. Thank you very much for joining to the first class of your model. Thank you, and see you tomorrow Tuesday. Have a good rest. Bye, teacher. See you tomorrow. Good morning. Bye, teacher. Bye, Bye, teacher. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye, teacher. Good night. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes,